come with here today. With fundraising. With fun, oh, that's good. I like that. It's Stephen again. Uh, I am um, the Outback Hypnotist. This is Kim Brees. Kim, Kim is from Brees Lawyers, and I've just found out all she does around here is mentor the other staff and takes a second job as a relationship counsellor, which just does with my head, but that's a totally different story. Every year you do lots and lots of different things to fundraise for different charities. We do. You do. And today it's not, you're not fundraising at all. You're no, just... we're just having fun. So um, we're recording this on Australia, the day before Australia Day, and I walked into this office and there are just... It's it's not a, a solicitor's office. It doesn't look like it at all. No one is wearing a suit, and most people are wearing some article of clothing with a Australian flag on it. So each year, Kim, oh look, I've got a list of a dozen different fundraising events that Kim and her team do each year. But we're going to talk about the slippers. We are. We are. Crazy slippers. Crazy slippers. So what happens there? So we fundraise once a year for mm -hmm. Lifeline, it's yes. for their counselling service, mm -hmm. and it's called Stress Down Day, or pretty much wear your slippers to work. So it's an opportunity, you buy some crazy big feeded slippers from Lifeline mm -hmm. store, or we wear our own slippers, and make donations and we get to come to work and... So you specifically go to the Lifeline store to buy the slippers? No, no, they have an online store oh, to buy they? new crazy slippers each right. year. So okay. you can have yeah, giant feet with all sorts of things, but yeah, these and, are mine. And everyone gets involved? Everyone gets involved. We wear our slippers to work, we make a donation to Lifeline. Uh, last year we gave $500 to okay. be able to wear our slippers to work. Right. And we get some photos and... Yeah, and just have, have, a a great, have a great yeah, time. We do. And, and do, okay, look, let's, actually, I'm disappearing off the screen you now. Are. Um, you do this an awful lot, don't you? We do. Okay. We, we usually try and do something at least once a month. Okay. And, and is the reasoning behind that just because I really like giving stuff, or is there some sort of a business thing in the background too? We have a heart for the community, so mm -hmm. we like to give both financially and our time, and look, we like to have fun. Okay. We don't like being a stiff suited law firm, so if it's an opportunity Look, to get... Look, here today, they are not a stiff... <laughs> no. no, no, today's sausage sizzle day. Stiff um, suited. Luckily this will air after we've had our sausage sizzle so that we don't have, you know, a hundred people show up for a free sausage and You're we're not, not quite yeah, ready This isn't going to air for a couple of weeks, so remember Australia Day. when oh. we. But, so, so, so on that day, on, on the day that you do your slippers... Yes. Um, I don't know. I just don't know what to say about that. It's just so far outside the thought of being a lawyer. Can can you do me a favour? Can yes. you just take your hat off for a minute? Oh, I've got hat hair. Oh, have you? <laughs> because we couldn't see you. Okay, but the hat did look great. Now, yeah, hat hair. So 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 there's no real time involved here. You see, what I normally ask people is. How much money did it cost to do it? How much time did you use to do it? All that sort of stuff. But this is just something you do as a part of your day. Pretty much, yeah. It's just part of who we are and what we do at Breeze Lawyers is get involved in community stuff, give back to the community. Yep. Um, and yeah, we have heaps throughout the, the year. So stress down day, we love because we get to wear our slippers to work. We, we really loved uh, pyjama day for the Pyjama Foundation. We wore our flannies to work. Okay. Luckily that one's in winter. Um, really loved RSPCA day, yeah. so we did cupcake day for RSPCA and we brought a couple of our pets to work. So we had a lovely little oh, really? beagle and a golden retriever, were our office who, who, mascots who did for the, the day. Who uh, They're very well behaved dogs right. that got taken for a walk a few times during the day. Right, so. okay, excellent. Now this is interesting, um, this, this is something that just keeps happening. And every year, do you do, do, you, do, you do the same things each year? Um, a lot of the causes we do stick with just because the girls basically look forward to it. Yeah. Uh, but we do, we're always looking for new ones. So if it's an opportunity to dress up, decorate the office, we pretty much do it. So Australia Day finishes tomorrow, we'll take down our Australia flags and I think we're getting ready for Love Month and putting up Valentine's things. So maybe you can pop in what, in February what, and okay, get a Okay, so who do you support during Love Month? <laughs> we're supporting the idea of love. <laughs> So, so that one might not be a fundraiser, that's right. just uh, an opportunity to, okay. de to decorate and celebrate. Um, not sure what our next fundraiser one is on the calendar because they're always popping up. How so. many people at Brewer with Breeze Lawyers? 24. Okay, so for those people in business out there with the 20 odd staff, this is something that you could do that will cost you nothing, that will really benefit your staff? The staff lover is really good for team morale. 
Dress up days are fun days in the office. Okay. Dress up days are fun days in the office. It's like being at school, isn't it? It is. Kim, thank you. Thank you.